New York Fashion Week has kicked off and amid the glitz and glamour, world famous Jewish designer Michael Kors has been honoured with the 2013 Couture Council Award. Kors spoke highly of New York's Fashion Institute of Technology or FIT, which the Couture Council was created to support. Well, it's very, very, very exciting. I mean, I, I went to FIT um, and, you know, I have to say that the museum at FIT and, and the libraries at FIT were such an inspiration to me when I was a student, continue to be. Um, so uh, these are people who are truly fashion aficionados who really understand all the work and, and the creativity that goes into fashion. So it's, it's, it's you know, it's a big honor. Celebrities and models praise Kors for his ability to make women feel great wearing his clothes. And I always feel sexy and glamorous in Michael's clothes and, um, you know, I feel like I'm an all-American girl, so it's very fitting. And like I said, he's a really great person and that's really rare in this business, so it's a, it's a, nice, it's a nice pairing. I get my first runway show I had on like a fur jacket and um, my hair was bone straight with like high boots and I just knew that I was supposed to be in Michael Kors because I felt good in it. <laughs> Kors said that his unusual entrance into the industry had ensured his designs remained relevant. Let's be frank, I don't have the traditional background that most designers have. I never worked for another designer picking up pins. I didn't finish school. I'm a nightmare at the sewing machine. Controversially, New York Fashion Week started during the Jewish holiday of Rosh Hashanah, leaving Kors and other Jews facing a dilemma, whether to anger the fashion gods or the real one. 